hello everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice exponential problem and here we have 9 to the power of x plus 3 to the power of x is equal to 1 and we will solve this problem for the value of x uh, so the very first thing we are going to do is uh, here I will uh, uh, rearrange the terms of this problem and here we have 9 to the power of x and we will uh, first uh, divide each side by uh, this 9 of the power of x so that uh, this expression um, will becomes 9 to the power of x over 9 to the power of x plus 3 to the power of x over 9 to the power of x is equals to 1 over 9 to the power of x so after that uh, here we see that this is these terms are gone and here we get <coughs> 1 plus here we can uh, combine the exponent of both of the terms so we can write it as 9 3 over 9 to the power of x is equal to uh, here we can write uh, uh, this expression as 1 over 9 to the power of x <clears throat> so after that we will make some simplification of the terms and we can uh, rewrite the terms as 1 plus here uh, this is uh, cancel out the terms and 3 3 is a 9 so here we get 1 over 3 to the power of x is equals to here we will write 9 as 3 square and its whole power x after that uh, we will uh, use here uh, the exponential law and you know that uh, if we have a to the power of m to the power of n is equals to a to the power of m times of n but if we will interchange these exponents then again uh, we will uh, get this same term so that uh, here uh, in the right hand side I will first uh, uh, interchange these exponents and then we will get here 1 plus 1 over 3 to the power of x is equals to 1 over 3 to the power of x and <clears throat> is whole square so now we make some simplification uh, so that we will take here uh, y is equals to 1 over 3 to the power of x <clears throat> so that this expression will becomes 1 plus y is equals to here we can put 1 over 3 to the power of x as y so it will become y square so now we move all the terms in the left hand side to the right hand side so that uh, the remaining terms will get in this form y square minus y minus 1 is equals to 0 <coughs> so after that we will get here uh, this quadratic equation and uh, we we can use here quadratic formula in order to solve this uh, quadratic equation so that here we have a is equals to 1 b is equals to minus 1 and c is equals to minus 1 so that uh, we can apply here the quadratic formula and the quadratic formula is y is equals to minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac square root over 2 times of a so now we can substitute all the values of a b and c uh, here and we will get y is equal to here you have minus b and the value of b is oh. is minus 1 so when we substitute this value here so this minus and minus will becomes plus 1 plus minus here you have b square and b is equals to minus 1 so minus 1 square is equals to plus 1 plus sorry minus here you have 4 times of a and c and the value of a is 1 and the value of c is minus 1 so this minus and minus will becomes plus 1 and this 4 times of 1 is equals to 4 so it will becomes 1 plus 4 and its square root over 2 times of a and the value of a is 1 so it will becomes 2 so now we can uh, simplify the terms and it will become 1 plus minus 
square root of 5 over 2 so here we have two cases the first case is we take y is equal to 1 plus square root 5 over 2 and the other case is we take y is equal to 1 minus square root of 5 over 2 so uh, when we can open the square root of 5 and we will get uh, square root of 5 is equals to 2.23 1 plus 2.23 2 3 over 2 similarly we will uh, open the square root of this term and it will become 1 minus 2.23 over 2 so that we will get the value of y is y is equal to here you have 1 plus 2.23 so 1 plus 2.23 is equal to 3.23 over 2 and similarly here we have y is equal to 1 minus 2.23 so <coughs> it is uh, after divided by 2 it will becomes minus 0 0.615 so here when we divide it by 2 and it will become 1.61 so uh, in the start of the question we will take uh, uh, y is equals to 1 over 3 to the power of x so we will back substitute the value of y and it will become 1 over 3 to the power of x is equal to 1.61 and similarly we will substitute here and it will become 1 over 3 to the power of x is equal to minus 0 0.615 so here uh, you focus on the right hand side and uh, you can see that uh, the value of exponential function is negative and we know that the exponential function uh, cannot give us uh, the negative value so we will reject it this case and we will just proceed here this case only so in order to find the value of x we will take the logarithm on both of the sides and it will becomes 1 over 3 to the power of x is equals to log of 1.61 so here we apply the uh, property of log and according the property of log uh, this exponent will become in the front of this log and it will become x time of log 1 over 3 is equal to log of 1.61 so now we move this log 1 over 3 to the right hand side <coughs> and it will become x is equals to log of 1.61 over log of 1 over 3 so this is the final value of x and this is our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel for more exciting videos